Okay, the first order of business is getting the rebars that are kind of crisscrossing and getting the way of everything out of our way. So this one is over here and it's a 10 footer. So that's gonna be forming the inside wall of this grotto space boulder. So wanna get that and you just, you kind of weave it around and get it to go inside everything. And then you just push it up so that that's out of the way. Um, <coughs> starting the outside in, gonna work on this rolled boulder, which is sort of the bookend of this one. Now I wanna try and keep an eye on the, the symmetry. Are we making things starting to match? Are they gonna be uh, uh, complementary in the design, which is what we want? So I might uh, lean this out a little bit and have a pitched wall this way, which is uh, sort of going towards the center point. Um, but I'm gonna, I'll keep playing with it, but you kind of step back, look at your work, bathroom trip, come back, look at what's going on, go, okay, oh, that's kind of goofy, or let me switch and adjust that, because now's the time to do it, guys. But uh, got to get these big horizontals kind of out of our, out of our hair till we're uh, working on this section, and then we'll begin to do like the other side I talked about, making those uprights and establishing that outer, outer surface of this boulder like we did over here. And you can see it's coming out straight and then begins to roll back. Always remember to have angles, not horizontal lines in terms of the rock shape. Okay. <laughs> 